Hello, my name is Jason Miller. I'm the corporate executive chef for Balducci's Food Lovers Market, and today we're going to make a classic local Maryland cream of crab soup. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do today when making our classic Maryland uh, cream of crab soup is we're going to make a crab stock. There's so many times that you eat out in this area in the Chesapeake Bay region and you eat cream of crab soup that doesn't taste like crab. So um, the most important thing about making a soup is having a real good stock. So, um, so we have some crab bodies here. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to roast them. Now you can do this two ways. You can uh, just go ahead and, and roast them in the, in the pan that we're going to cook the stock in, or you can just roast them in the oven, which we're going to do right now just to save a little time, and we're going to do kind of a larger batch. So um, I have these crab bodies here, and these are, like I said, these are called gumbo crabs. Uh, you can kind of get them anywhere uh, if you want to use, we're in Maryland, so, uh, and uh, we're going to take them over to the oven and we're going to roast them. So over here, we have a hot pot. This is called a Rondo. So just, just a touch of oil, what we're going to do. So, got a nice nice color on these crab bodies here. You got all this color on the bottom of the pan. Um, all this kind of, uh, you know, charred bits of uh, crab, and that's called fond. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to deglaze this pan with a little bit of white wine so I can break up some of that fond and break up the crab so that it comes off the tray easier. And here's kind of what you got. We got our finished roux. It's cooked for about 10 or 15 minutes. So we have our roux made. We have our stock made. So now we're going to cream the soup. Now you think, you know, we're eating cream of crab soup. It's got all this cream in it. It's not healthy. But I, you haven't seen any cream yet. Look, already it looks so creamy. I got just a little bit of heavy cream. And all I'm going to do is add about a cup. Now at this stage, our soup's thick, we've got our cream, now it's time to add just a little bit of seasoning. And I have some claw meat, uh, you know, I'm a big fan of claw meat, I think it actually tastes the best. And we're going to go ahead and garnish this soup. That's we'll put it all in here. Just a little, little fresh crab meat. We'll add just a little bit of greens in here, you can use anything. Alright, that's how you make a classic Maryland style cream of crab soup. Uh, thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon.